Did you know that a railroad accident completely changed how we understand the human brain? On September 13th, 1848, 25-year-old Phineas Gage was working as a foreman in Cavendish, Vermont. He was known as a reliable, well-mannered supervisor who earned respect from every worker. That morning, he was preparing explosives for blasting rock when something went terribly wrong. The gunpowder ignited early, launching a 43-inch iron rod straight through his skull. The rod entered below his left eye and shot out the top of his head, taking chunks of brain with it. Somehow, Gage remained conscious and walked to get medical help. But the man who survived was not the same person. The polite, responsible foreman became vulgar, impulsive, and completely unpredictable. He lost all social control and couldn't hold a job. Doctors found massive damage to his frontal lobe, the part controlling personality. Gage ended up performing in circus shows, displaying his horrific injuries for money. He died young, but his case proved that personality lives in specific parts of the brain.